almost hand-sized plate of feldspar. And sitting on top of this feldspar, we have some agerine crystals and some quartz crystals. Of course, feldspar crystals too. Mild coating of girthite on some of these quartzes. Now, this could be, uh, uh, the girthite could be removed by using a product called Iron Out, which you have in the States. The only thing is that it would attack the feldspar, so it will burn the feldspars and turn them into snow white. So there's a bit of an iron oxides coating on some of these crystals. What I like about this piece is the, the when you look down, uh, you can clearly see the terminations of the agerines across there. Also very, very nicely positioned. Let me just take it around like this. And a good size, uh, 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 well, almost a hand size. And look at that sort of flat, flat quartz crystal uh, growing out the side of that agerine crystal. All the way from the Zomba Plateau, Mount Melosa, Malawi. So let's give you a sideways view again. So standing flat, we'd have this look around like that. Just like that. And then looking from the top down, we'd have this effect. Quite, quite lovely. Ah, look at that.